Yo, hey guys, in this video we are going to talk about how you can play Mobile Legends Bang Bang on your PC. I get asked this all the time on stream and I get asked which key bindings I use, how I set up my settings and everything like that. So I'm going to go through that and more during this video. So I hope you guys enjoy that. First off, the first thing you have to do is download BlueStacks. You can do that from their website. I'll leave a link in the description so you guys can just click it, go on the website and download it for yourself. And yeah, once you have it downloaded, I'm going to show you how to set it up right now. So once you have it installed and open it up, it should look something like this. Mobile Legends, all these games might be missing, but you can just head on to Google Play Store here and you can uh, search up Mobile Legends and you should be able to download it right here. And once it's downloaded, it should be in your library right here. But before you start playing the game, you need to do something inside your bio settings. You would probably get a notification in here about it, but you need to enable your virtualization. I'm gonna throw a link down in the description on how you do that. It's very complicated and it kind of changes whether what graphic cards and stuff you have, how you're gonna do it. So I'll put a link down in the description on how you enable that and uh, yeah, I'm going to show you instead how I did my settings for BlueStacks. Down the wheel, down the bottom right corner here, you can click it and you'll see the settings for your BlueStack. I used landscape, tablet mode, and 1920 1080 and 240 dpi inside the display settings. I find this to work best for me. And then in the engine, I use OpenGL and I prefer dedicated computer graphics, NVIDIA only. For the ASTC texture beta, I disabled it. And the most important thing is the performance, guys. You want to go into this and you want to take the custom one. And then you want to select, I use four CPU cores, that's what works great for my PC. And then I just give it max memory I can here. And for the FPS, you just want to do 60. If your computer can do it. And that should be everything you want to do inside the settings here. Alright, so now I'm going to launch the games and I'm going to tell you what my settings are in game and what my key bindings are in there. Alright, I'll be right back with you guys. Guys, we're now back inside a practice mode inside Mobile Legends. First thing, one thing you really need to know is you don't want to full screen your game by clicking this. You want to press F11. It's going to allow you to enter complete full screen, no borders, no nothing. That's one of the great things about BlueStacks. I tried some other emulators where you weren't able to do this and you would have like this ugly border to it it's not nice so f11 guys and now let's move on to our settings for mobile legends right let me just go ahead and just shut these lanes out if you go into settings these are the settings i use no old lines camera i use in high so we can see more skill vibration i don't think it matters that much since we're not really on a mobile device hd mode on high frame rate mode on shadows off it will probably like the system if you have shadows on and you want to take on damage text of course colorblind filter <coughs> of course that's a preference if that's something you need definitely use that and then you want optimize fps graphics the highest you can run for me it's high you want to go to the bottom and make sure you have speed mode on guys Alright, for controls, this is basically what you would normally do on your mobile, I use advanced aim. And then for cast cancelling, I will very heavily suggest you use this, instead of the one where you just drag it far away. Because on the computer, you will have to drag the skills a bit further in order to aim them. So definitely use the old one here. And yeah, that should be it for mobile legend settings. Now moving on to the most important part for most of the people watching this video, is probably the key binds in which I use. <clears throat> so let me just go ahead and open this up okay so there's two ways in order to play this game you can play it like League of Legends where you click around on the screen in order to move and then use key bindings to use your skills I do not recommend this way because you need your mouse in order to aim skill shots and also it seems very finicky when you move around with left click or with clicking around so I use WSD to move around as you can see down here I use B for back, G for heal, F for the spell I have done here. And then to level up skills, I use 1, 2, 3, because that seems very really dynamic. I can also just click the skills, of course. And then for my skills, 
I use Q, E and R. I have R's two places, because when you play people like Marcia, where they have more than one skill, it's sometimes swift shift a slit a little bit. So that's why I have them two places. And then I use shift to activate any sort of items, sort of like the Bromo items. And then I have a key binding to buy the items with my mouse, the two side buttons. And in order to auto attacks, use space, and I use tap for changing targets and right click for changing the other target. I'm gonna upload this file, this whole config, and then put it in the description on the YouTube. So you guys can just download it and import it. So if you go into your, these advanced game settings, I'm just gonna discard it. You go in here, you say game guide, and then there should be an import button. So you do want to download the file, I'll give you guys, and then you can just import it right in. And then if you want to do some changes, you can just click it and then change it to whatever you want, okay? So that should be everything for the movement here. This is how I have it set up. One thing that is very important to note, guys, is Bluestack doesn't allow you to aim your skill for your skills if you just click the button. So for example, this skill, you don't really need to aim with it, it's just around you, so you can just click uh, E for that. But the hook, you want to click with your mouse, and then you can aim it like this, where you drag the mouse around. This makes it a little bit harder to play on PC, especially if you have heroes like Gaussian and stuff, where you have to use a lot of skill shot in a row. You, you, you just can't really do that, so it's, heroes like Gaussian is a lot easier on, the, on mobile devices instead of PC, but Heroes Like Frankel works great with this because you don't have that many skill shots and yeah, that's everything for this guide guys. I hope I got everything in here. If I did forget something, please leave it down in the comments and I'll try to import it next time. I'm quite sort of new to these, new, these videos where I just talk about what I'm doing. So I hope you enjoy. Leave, do leave a like if you did. If you want to see more Bluestacks video, make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll be back next time guys. Thank you for watching. I'll see you. Bye. I don't